Hi, uh, my name is Jeremy, and this is my first vlog I've ever done. I'm still going to be reading off a script here. Uh, I'm in Fiji right now, uh, which is pretty cool. I've been here for less than a week. I got here last Tuesday, and it's Sunday here right now. Uh, I'm still getting used to things here. Uh, right when I got off the airplane, one of the people who coordinated this volunteer trip, she took me straight from the airport to a local school where I did some tutoring. I met one of the other volunteers and we ran a PE class with the kids. And it was really great. Um, and so the volunteer organization we're with is called Help International. We're staying in this house here near the town of Sabu Sabu in Fiji. And I wish you could see more behind me. It's really beautiful here. And so yeah, we're, we're volunteering here. And a few nights ago, they, the coordinators showed us a TED talk called uh, Want to Help People? Shut Up and Listen. And it's by Ernesto Ciroli. Uh, he talked about the way that people like us volunteers, humanitarians, sometimes we can go to a country with good intentions and and wind up either not helping anyone or working on things that wind up causing harm in the country. And I've been thinking a lot about that because obviously all of us, we want to do good while we're here. We want to help the people of Fiji. And we want to have a long-term lasting benefit. And so far, I've been here for five days. I don't really know how to accomplish that yet. But it's not like we're doing nothing. We've been going around to a lot of schools and tutoring kids. Some of us are helping local farmers and entrepreneurs grow their business. And that's good, but some of the things we're doing, like the tutoring, once we leave, I can imagine that things would just go back to normal and then the kids who struggle will still just keep struggling. And that's tough to think about because the, the big question that I have on my mind, and I think we all have on our minds probably, is just how can we help Fiji? And I don't have an answer for that yet because I'm just one guy and I've only been here for five days. But we've got a really good team of people here, really intelligent, compassionate people. And I'm confident we can figure something out. We've got three more months, or about a month and a half, two months left here. And that's enough time to really get to know the people here and figure out some good solutions. And hopefully in my next vlog I'll have more to tell you about because I'll have been here longer, done more stuff. And I look forward to telling you more because I'm excited about this trip and I'm excited about working with all these people here. So that's it for today. Thank you for watching and I hope you'll come back next time.